Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks. And somebody was asking me how to do a page curl. Now, I've only ever done it one, th one time and I had to do a little research. But if you'll go to Windows, Dockers, Properties, and just pick something like, I don't even know what that means right now, but pick that FX, press Add Effect, let's go to 3D and do a page curl. Let's move this out of the way so we can see it. It looks like the page has been curled. You can do it vertically, horizontally. Uh, you can do it opaque looking. You can change the color of the page curl. Let's go to, well, of course, if you're doing this in color, you would be using um, uh, something other than RGB. But I like using RGB because I know what the colors are. You make it yellow, it's kind of a gold. It adds that opaque look to it. You know, you can do the width, you know, make it really curl. Uh, this would be pretty cool on a, uh, you know, some sort of printed t-shirt or something, make it look like it's curled. But I thought while I'm here, I'm also going to show you a couple of things you could do with text when you use this 3D effect. You can do this with the envelope tool, but if you'll go to 3D rotate, you can actually rotate the text a little bit, kind of like give it perspective. Here's another little cool one real quick. Go to down to distort and wet paint. And look at that. It looks like it. you drew it and it would look better, a lot better with a different font but it looks like it ran. Anyway, I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.